wish I could make that the intro. <laughs> <laughs> Stupid Rex, you idiots, I'm Corbin. I'm Ashley. I'm floating. Whee. And you can follow us on Instagram, Instagram and Twitter for more juicy content. It's so juicy. Feel that? Ew. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like that. Uh, I don't like it. I don't like it one bit. Today, what we do, Corbin Miles, we are reacting to the best Indian and Western classical fusion. Awesome, don't know what it is, but I'm game. It's Dabar, the Dabar Festival. Oh, cool. But it's <laughs> a, what happened to you? It's, it's a mixture of uh, gin and, and tonic. Yes, Indians and uh, Indian classical instruments and Western instruments playing together. Sweet. This so. is good. Oh, this is gonna probably be phenomenally awesome. Uh, I mean, everything. I'm seems... waiting for the day we watch one of these things and Pedro shows up. Ah. Vote for Pedro. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Ron Pedro, but uh, we love that Pedro.
Oh, um, what I please let me know the proper name for the instrument that because I know it's not called a pot, but it looks like he was banging <laughs> yeah, on the, the pot. Percussion, the, the percussion instrument. Yeah. Yeah. So what is the percussion called? I know it's not. I know it's not called a pot. Um, but because yeah, they he said was it. Killing it. <laughs> they they said it when they yeah. showed it, and I, I we've seen it before, but I'm forgetting as well what it, uh, what, what, it, what the actual called. name is. Yeah, the actual uh, name of the instrument because he was he was killing it. Um, <sighs> and then it was really because each time they did like the boom boom, they would fuse. It's called fusion, but they would go into the western, and then mm -hmm. they would go into the eastern, yes. and eastern, then back to the western, and it was like each time. And so I thought it was very creative. Uh, yeah, and what's interesting I've noticed about the instruments from India that have frets is they are able to be bent really uh -huh. uh, always because they have to yeah. play the in-between notes in the modalities of Eastern music, like which are different than the West. Yeah, mm -hmm. um, which with, with, the, um, with the violin and the cello and the viola, those are fretless instruments which allow you to play the in-between notes that uh, fall. Don't fret. Yeah, it's true. Sure. That fall in between. But I noticed that instrument, which we have seen that other uh, wonderful lady yeah, she played, played the breathless. She, really she, yeah, she played the breathless and was looking at us like, "Hi, aren't I so awesome?" Yeah, she was awesome. We loved her. <laughs> but I noticed. I don't know why I missed this when we watched her her video, but this time I noticed that the frets on that are raised and also grooved. Yeah, they are for the fingers and mm -hmm. in between. I didn't notice. Yeah, the, the technicality. It's so crazy! It's, I was like, "This is a very complicated instrument." Can you play guitar? Not well. Not well. Yeah. What instrument? Do you play? I can play piano, and I can sort of play guitar, just not very well. Don't yeah. ask me to do it. <laughs> play most. If there's one instrument I could play, it'd be the fiddle. I've always wanted to play the fiddle. Yeah. Oh, that's so fun. I don't know. I just, I've They're always the most. Do it, Corbin. The, the string instruments <laughs> don't do have it. any time. <laughs> <laughs> no, the string, the string instruments are the ones that convey, particularly the bow strings instruments, like the like the, oh. the violin, the fiddle, and the viola. They they convey so much emotion. Mm -hmm. uh, and and you just you could feel especially like last night with Micah at John Williams, so much of the string arrangements that he does are so gorgeous, mm -hmm. uh, and they're, they emote so much. Uh, the the and musical musical artistry is the one for me, and you may agree that is the most clearly technically difficult. Mm -hmm. The most subtly difficult on the technical side of things, artist-wise, is visual artistry and acting, mm -hmm. where there isn't, uh, unless you're really aware of what people can be doing and in a, in a, you've been trained, mm -hmm. it's not as visibly obvious how hard it is. This is visibly obvious how hard oh, it is. Oh, yeah. You see their hands moving like <laughs> yeah, there, this. There's probably not a dance form, I mean, a, an art form. Dance as well can show you how visibly difficult the art form is, but it's deceiving because some of the best and greatest dancers make it look easy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This is just transcendently, not just the technical difficulty of what they're doing, but being able to read the music and... And, and do that. Yeah, and what's... The, uh, watching John Williams again last night, these, this level of artistry, they're the kind of musicians who can sit down with a chart and have never seen it. And just mm -hmm. play it. And right. just nail it. I mean, you have to hear. Uh, like the LA Philharmonic is usually used as our studio musicians to score film. And you have to be good enough that whatever's put in front of you, you can play it without rehearsing. You can just sit down and play it in one take and then walk out. If you're not that good, you won't be in the Philharmonic. Mm -hmm. You won't be a studio musician. I don't think I will be. Yeah, it's, 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 it's the, the level of mastery and you know it's crazy. And incredible. to sight read. Oh my goodness. Yeah. The the amount of percussion instruments we've seen, but most are played by hand that we've seen, which yeah. is different than yeah. Western percussion. Yeah. Most true. of them are played with sticks of some sort. Sticks of some sorts, whether it's the timpani. The only one or I can the think of set. hands is the the box that the drummers sit on. Yeah. They they. They play, yeah. which is probably inspired by Eastern. Yeah, no, I think if you if you think the majority of the Western of percussion, another percussion one that's instruments played with a, your hands, can you? No, the majority of those would come from the East or from Symbols, from Latin America. Yeah, that yeah. are that are all hand. Yeah, uh, I mean maybe I don't know where it came from. I guess is India the tambourine? That's a popular Western instrument. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, that's played that's with true. just the hand, as is the cowbell. No, you use no, a stick you, you for the cowbell. No, you use a stick for the cowbell. I know, I just wanted to say cowbell. Because like, <laughs> I was thinking about the triangle. Gotta have more cowbell. This was beautiful. That was great.